Hey, hello everyone. My name is Ravindra, and I welcome you to my YouTube channel. In this video, we are seeing how to open Azure account without credit card. Okay, in 2025, completely free. This video is only for the learning and the student use only. So, friends, I know time is valuable. So, without wasting too much time, let's go and see the Microsoft Azure. Okay, so you can see. I'm on my personal email ID using Microsoft Learn Sandbox, okay? And by using this, I can able to access the all Microsoft services. Here you can be see, I'm accessing the storage account, okay? And all other services I can easily access by using this account, okay? So let's go and see how to create this Microsoft uh, Azure account, okay? for free of cost okay we will not waste the time so for that purpose i have write and one microsoft blog post you can follow this the link is available in the description box okay from there you can check so for that purpose you need to have an account on the microsoft learn so simply i just opening the first link this link is also available in the description box from there you can directly jump in okay then i going and click on the sign in okay for the sign in purpose you can add your personal email id here okay so here i adding my own personal email id savinch at the rate savinch blogs at the rate gmail.com okay and simply click on the next here okay i cross validating my email id okay yeah it is correct now click on the next but it is saying my account is does not exist okay so we need to create a new account okay so i simply click in on create new account so it is asking me for the create account okay so i simply click on next here then i creating a password here okay for the security purpose create the complex password so no one able to hack it okay simply i just click on create next then provide here your region date of birth okay so mine i providing here 10th may 2002 so it is asking for verification code so i just going for to the gmail and taking the verification code from here okay yep access the verification code and simply using the same code here okay So it is asking to solve the robo problem okay so let's we solve this problem here okay so first one i just type okay it is wrong it is saying try again so let's try one more time this time we try to be correct <laughs> so first one we done let's do one more time and now it is done our account is created now hope so yes our account is created successfully we are navigating to the another screen now just simply click on the next here okay we have to use the same account provide the display name so i provided my display name sa winch okay Click on next, selecting the region. I am from the India region. So I simply select the India here and simply click on the next here. Okay. And uh, click here back to learn. So here it is simply verifying my account. Okay. This assignment is also completed. Okay. I successfully line sign up to the Savinch. Okay. You can be see. I simply now verifying this account by solving the puzzle. Now it is activating the learn sandbox. Okay, so we are using this learn sandbox for the learning purpose only. Okay, Microsoft Azure. So here if we have one tab review permission. So simply click on that and accept the permissions here. Simply okay. So I successfully accepted the permission. So it is verifying 
okay it taking some time for the verification purpose so friends uh, now we will go to our blog post one more time okay so now it is asking to open the portal.azure.com okay so i simply on the portal.azure.com and you need to sign in to the by using your gmail id okay and this pop up will display how do you want to plan to use azure so you can tick mark this or you can skip this option as well okay this is just survey so i click on the next okay click on the store okay so now you can friends you can be see you are successfully able to access the microsoft learn sandbox account in this you can use the microsoft azure for the learning purpose only okay and you can easily create the labs and other things okay here you can be see we have the learn.microsoft.com domain and the microsoft sandbox account okay so from here you can easily create the storage account and other things you can also perform the labs here okay all other things you can be easily do okay this sandbox will activate for the 60 minutes okay and um, i i just showcase you uh, how to create some of the features okay let's we go and showcase you the virtual machine one okay so you can be see now i'm not prompting for the sign up or sign in i can easily create the virtual machines and any other thing i can easily access thank you friends keep learning keep growing